this is a vegetarian, uh, extremely healthy, poor man's meal, okay? It has almonds, oats, egg, dried peas, which obviously not dry anymore, but they were dried peas that I prepared myself, um, broccoli, carrot, and then pepper, salt, and sriracha sauce for seasoning. And we, of course, have some tea, the total cost of which, like all of this, costs about uh, $2.20, it would be, in uh, US dollars. I live in Norway, so if you live in the US, honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if you could make this for like $1.50 if you do the same things that I do. In the UK, probably like $1.80, so, like, this is the worst case scenario, as long as you buy the cheapest shit you can find in your place. It should not exceed the cost of what I paid, considering all food items here have like 25% tax on them, so. Anyway. What you have here is obviously the vegetables, and then you have the mixture of oats, egg, and almond. And I'm going to take you through how to make this, so you can do it yourself. So, as you can see on your screen now, you should be watching on your phone, uh, you can see that we first put some butter in the pan, nonstick in my case, and then you don't have to really wait for the butter to melt, you can put water in there as well. Not a lot of water, just enough to soak the mixture of almonds and oats. Now, these are obviously ground almond. I bought some almonds and then I ground them myself. You can do this with a rotary grater or a, like a blender of some sort, I guess whatever you have, and um, so you put them in, you mix it together with the water, you can add a little bit of water if you need to, you just want to soak them a little bit but not make them wet, you don't want any water running around inside of the pan afterwards, you want to, to soak it all up, just so that it's wet, but not like a porridge. Then when the butter is melted and you've mixed the butter in, you kind of mix them around so that it's all nice and buttered up. You can crack a couple of eggs in there, medium to large eggs, whatever cheap eggs you can find basically, and you mix them together. And quite simply, that's it. You kind of just cook them and they'll look like what you see on the screen now. You can dish that out, form it into a nice semicircle like I have, and then uh, Basically, just add vegetables to it, whatever you want. In my case, broccoli, peas, and carrot. Add some sriracha sauce, and some pepper, maybe. Some salt, and you've got a meal. Now, the nutrients and, and nutritional stuff that you get from this is on the screen now. So you can see that this is not an unhealthy meal. This is an extremely healthy meal. It has a lot of protein especially considering that it doesn't have any meat. There's a lot of protein for a vegetarian meal in here. It has a lot of carbs. It has quite a bit of fat, but it's not all bad fat. Most of the fat, uh, or like a good half of the fat, is honestly from the almonds and stuff like that. There's obviously fat from the butter that you used, but a good part of the fat is not from, um, from the uh, butter. Then you obviously have the vegetables giving a lot of uh, the vitamins you need and whatever else. So, honestly, if you need a healthy dinner, and you want it to be cheap, and this is dirt cheap, I would recommend this wholly. It tastes, uh, to me anyway, delicious, and it is pretty easy to make. The only thing to do, really, is prepare the peas the day or two before. What I do is I get dried peas. They come in like a little box like this. This is 500 grams of dried peas, and it, when it's wet, it becomes about 1.3 kilos. So, 1.3 kilos for about 90 cents. That's a lot of, uh, 1.3 kilos is about, um, uh, it's about three pounds. Closing in. Yeah, well, closing in on three pounds, maybe like 2.8, 2.9 pounds, if I'm not wrong. And, uh, that's a lot for 90 cents, I think. So that's by far the cheapest component of this by weight. 
Uh, well, other than the oats, of course. I highly recommend it. Uh, and, of course, as a drink, we have tea. This is just regular fruit tea with no milk, sugar, or anything like that. And uh, you can't see it because of the angle, but uh, it's delicious. Dirt cheap. And it is included in the cost, by the way. Everything is included in the cost. Now, I want you to look at this. This is an audience retention graph for my eating videos. And the drop-off point there is when people hop off. Well, that's also when I start eating, coincidentally. This seems to be a pattern. People listen to me speak, and then I eat, and then they fuck off. Hi. It's an eating video. Uh, but I'm not going to be finishing the meal because of this. It just kind of tanks the performance of the video. But if you have made it so far, awesome. Thank you. It um, would be really nice if you could, like, you know, watch a little bit beyond just uh, the information in the beginning. But, um, you do. There are variations you can do of this meal. For example, you can add meat to this. If you mix in some bacon bits with the um, almonds and oats, you get almost like a English breakfast. Except it's not at all. <laughs> but it's like not too far off, you know what I'm saying? It's uh, got the eggs, you got the bacon, and you got the carbs in another form. And honestly, that would be a pretty hearty meal. Although, do not forget vegetables. You can't really claim to be eating healthily if you're not taking in vegetables. That just doesn't make any sense. If you're wondering. By weight. This is about... It's about um, 400 and, yeah, about 475 grams. I don't know what that is in ounces. 475 grams of um, vegetables. That's about right. That's about right. That's a, that's about what your healthy meal ought to consist of. Protein and carbs should together be less than half of the meal. You gotta eat vegetables, dude. This is so fucking good. Actually, you know, 
sit there and they, they watch. They enjoy it. I do try to make these enjoyable. my numbers up. And that's pretty fun. It makes my experience enjoyable. And usually my experience being enjoyable is the result of your experience being enjoyable. So it's sort of like a win-win. Make it a 